today if I spend the next half an hour sniffing. Uh, yeah, I might kill half of you off. But uh, Jane tells me she's also contagious as well, so you're in good company. Jane! Don't say this before you go from here. Hey, fever! You might want to stay out there just to be on the safe side. She's contagious. Yum, yum. Okay, so ladies and gentlemen, if we can welcome our first guest to the stage, uh, Jane Sherwin. And our second guest, uh, Mr. Rudolph Walker. And finally, Mr. Terence Baylor. Just getting up here, that round, wasn't it? <laughs> so, um, I know that a number of us today were hoping that you'd turn up in your ambulance. Oh, I'd love to. I mean, it was a beautiful, beautiful ambulance. But I, it came from some museum type thing, um, somewhere or other. But I like old cars. Very, very nice. I don't drive anymore. Um, I go by bus. It's actually much better for the planet. Well, and not only that, too. I mean, at, at, at our age, it's, 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 it's free. <laughs> <laughs> Let's be, let's be realistic. I mean, I, you know, it, it's sorry about that. Terribly sorry, we should be paying you more to be yeah, here. Yeah, yeah. No, 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 it's, it's quite all right. Be careful, because they may take it off. Oh, I see. So they, you know, they, they were paying us the bus fare. Uh, yeah, and now we don't know, you know. Yeah. Well, we paid for the last 50 or 60 <laughs> years. Right, the invoice will be adjusted on the way it's very nice having a, yeah, yeah, you can jump off and on places. Yes, very nice. Nice driving that ambulance, though. The only thing about it was, uh, the foot brake and the accelerator are the opposite way round. So, if you're in a hurry, you know, you could do the wrong thing. I was supposed to drive right up to the camera at one point. I never did it fast enough, because I was terrified I was going to stamp my foot on the accelerator and go, oh! you know, so, you know. But I drove the ambulance, whereas our esteemed Doctor Who said it was too dangerous and he didn't. But then I was the producer's wife. <laughs> <laughs> so as you hold through there, that'll be the outgoing producer's wife. Yeah, there. Right? Exactly. We won't be having him back for next season. <laughs> <laughs> so, a long time ago. So you were familiar with driving older cars then? Yes, yes. Yeah. Um, not because I was there when the first car was made. <laughs> <laughs> I couldn't be certain. <laughs> no, we just had quite a lot of old cars and, you know, yeah. So, um, in the context of the war games, how would you describe nepotism? <laughs> I would describe it as getting yourself out of an embarrassing situation. Because I was once somewhere when my husband was still an actor. I married him when he was an actor. Um, and I was in um, something up in Manchester where a director friend of mine uh, had his wife as one of the extras. And extras are always very bitchy about directors. And we were sitting, sitting in the corner once. And um, they all started bitching about this man. They didn't know she was his wife. But she knew that I knew that she was his wife. And it was very embarrassing. And I thought to myself, I never want to be in that position. So I gave up for about four years when my children were small. And when I went back, I went back under my married name. So that, if they said, is this nepotism? I could say, yes. <laughs> <laughs> so was it? <laughs> yes. <laughs> so did you get the job through Derek then, or was it David Maloney first? Ooh. <laughs> Oh, yeah. <laughs> How do I know? He was, he was, he, I knew David Bernie as well. I mean, I knew quite a lot of They used to come round to dinner, you know, people come round to dinner, friends. <laughs> 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 or maybe your friends don't come round to dinner. Uh, so, so they were looking through the budget then, and they were thinking, oh, we're running out of money, we need someone, we need someone who's free. It's like, my wife will do it. <laughs> she didn't do it for free. <laughs> So I think I was rather well cast. I think I was indeed. So for our two jobbing actors who had a slightly more difficult job. It was not that just no. No, 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 my job was um legit. Um <laughs> <laughs> you heard it here first. <laughs> Jane Sherwin was not legit. <laughs> <laughs> Did I say that? <laughs> no, she really inferred. Oh,